Hey there guys, today we're going to be looking at how to route uh, 2.3.6 on your Infuse 4G from AT&T and it's going to be quite simple. I'm going to leave a couple downloads in the bottom description for you to download. One of them is going to be keys and one of them is going to be a download package for the actual firmware that we're going to put on here. Once you have keys installed, um, let it do its updates. When you let it do its updates, it'll automatically install the drivers for your actual phone. Next thing you're going to do is download a file uh, that I'm going to give you a link to, and it's going to have the Odin along with the uh, .md5. Once you have both of those things up and ready to go, uh, you can go ahead and right click on the Odin and run it as administrator. Now what you need to do is take your phone and go ahead and power it off. Once it's completely off, we're going to go ahead and put it in download mode. So go ahead and hold both the up and down volume key. And then grab your cable and plug it into the device. Okay, now hit up to continue. Alright, now it's in download mode. And as you can see, it did pick it up. So come over here to PDA and then go to your file wherever it is and double click on the .md5 file. Once you have it in there, go ahead and click start. Now it's going to start pushing files over to it and downloading onto the device. There you have it. Now it says pass on the computer and it'll redo reboot your device. Finish up the installation. And reboot. And there you have it. You now have the 2.3.6 firmware rooted. As you can see, there is super user on there. And just to show you that it is on 2.3.6, we're going to go into settings and about phone. And as you can see, right there, it says 2.3.6 on the firmware. So there you have it, guys. We now have a rooted 2.3.6 gingerbread on your Infuge 4G at t If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, then go ahead and comment me or PM me below. Thanks for watching.